Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This has been a new challenge going around sa YouTube, sa beauty world ng YouTube. So, ang unang gumawa ng challenge na to ay si Nikki Tutorials. Basically, she does her makeup in alphabetical order. And I thought to myself na since matagal na ako hindi naggawa ng challenge video, I thought I would challenge myself to do this challenge. If you want to see how I fail or maybe succeed in this challenge, then please keep on watching. Lagay ko sa laptop ko yung list or um, mga process or steps na ginagawa ko kung naglalagay ako ng full face of makeup. Ang inuuna ko usually is primer, then foundation, then concealer, then baking powder, then face powder, then eyebrow pencil, eyebrow gel, eyeshadow, eyeliner, eyelash, mascara, bronzer, blush, lipstick, highlight, and lastly, yung setting spray. Kung i-categorize natin siya in alphabetical order, it will be baking powder, Powder, blush, bronzer, concealer, eyebrow gel. Since they're mostly eyebrow, eyeshadow, ganun. Um, eyebrow gel, eyebrow pencil, eyelash, eyeliner, eyeshadow, then face powder, foundation, highlight, lipstick, mascara, primer, and setting spray. So, all, all I do is I'm going to see my favorite super full coverage. First is yung baking powder. I honestly don't know how to do this because usually pinapatong ko yung powder ko on top of my creams because it blends a lot better. So, let us see kung mag work ba tong technique na to? I am using the BYS Banana Powder. This this is a technique that is good for people who have oily skin because the powder acts as yung parang absorbent or whatever yung term na yun for the oil. So, I think si Huda Beauty yung gumagamit ng technique na to. I usually give it like 20 seconds to 10, 10 seconds to 20 seconds to completely set sa face ko. And then, right after that, I just dust it off with a clean brush. Next step is blush. So, like what Nikki Tutorials did, she played around with the rules. So, it doesn't say naman na powder blush. And minsan naman, ginagamit ko yung powder brush, powder blush, and minsan din liquid type yung ginagamit ko. So, for today's video, gagamitin ko tong liquid type. So, ito yung NARS liquid blush in the shade Hot Tin Roof. Siguro dadamihan ko tong blush kasi yung 11th step is foundation. And I know na it will cover the blush. So at least my color sa ilalim ng skin ko na mukhang natural tignan. Let's see if this will really work. Because if not, ang weird ko tignan. Kwapa ko ng last. Tapos, i-intensify ko yung nandito sa area na to. Mukha akong binugbog. So, for this video, gagamitin ko tong bago kong bronzer. So, nabili ko to sa Pro Tools. You can check their Instagram accounts out. I'm not sponsored by them, but I love buying makeup from them. Because you can get cash on delivery and dun lang siya sa J-Mall i-pick up yung item. And that's really near my house. So that's why I love ordering from Pro Tools and guys, ang bilis niya dumating. Like if you buy, I if I buy today, makukuha ko na siya the next day. This is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Bronzer in the shade Radiant Bronze Light. And what I like about this is it's very buildable yung color ng bronzer, like hindi siya intense. But since this will be covered by other makeup products, gagawin nating intense yung ating bronzer. And also, what I love about this is meron siyang konting shimmer. So, it acts as like a highlight slash bronzer at the same time. Now, we're gonna be moving on to letter C, which is concealer. And as usual, kagamitin ko tong favorite ko, which is the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in the shade Ginger. Alam niyo na yun. If you guys have been an OG subscriber, then alam niyo how much I love this product. Mahirap siya i-blend kasi wala akong nilagay na anything, just powder sa face ko. Mukhang na-blend ko naman siya ng maayos. <laughs> Ang weird ko tignan. <laughs> okay, so next step is eyebrow gel. Ang ginagamit ko for my eyebrows, sika lang ko ako ng brush. So, ito yung ginagamit ko. This is the Maybelline Fashion Brow in the shade Dark Brown. So, ang ginagamit ko lang dito is itong gel part sa hindi, hindi talaga ako gumagamit itong dalawang powder. Fini-fill in ko muna yung kilay ko at at the same time, I'm making an outline. So, 
when I use an eyebrow pencil, what I usually just do is just fill in yung mga areas like this area right here na hindi na kuha nung eyebrow gel. So, next step sa eyebrows ko is my eyelashes. For my eyelashes, I'm gonna be using this pair of lashes that I got from oh, weird. <laughs> Para akong natagusan. <laughs> Uh, I got these lashes from Pro Tools. So again, I'll leave their Instagram account down below. So for my eyeliner, 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 I'm gonna be using this Maybelline Hyper Sharp Liner. So I'll be right back. Sa makeup routine ko ngayon is the eyeshadow. So meron ba ako malinis na brush? Parang wala. Okay, so I'm just gonna be using this eyeshadow palette from Yoyo So. It comes with a mirror, but I'm gonna block that for you guys. So, nagamit ko na tong palette na to, dun na dun kami sa Baguio, which, if you guys have not watched my Baguio vlog, I'm gonna leave the links down below. The first color I'm gonna be taking is, I'm actually gonna be taking this rosy pink color right here. And guys, super pigmented na tong product na to. So, a little bit goes a long way. What I do is just pinapat ko lang yung product and then tap. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to apply this all over my crease area. Do you guys see how nice the eyeshadow looks like? I'm gonna dim my lights. Para makita nyo ng mabute. So very, very pigmented. And I really love the colors. My palette din from Yoyo saw that I love, like I super duper love. Um, pero nine eyeshadows lang ang laman and di ko siya mahala for some reason. So next color I'm gonna be taking is I'm gonna take this shade right here, parang burnt orange shade, with the same brush and ilalagay ko lang siya dito sa my outer corners ng eye ko. Then to finish this very simple eye look, I'm gonna take this shimmery color right here and ilalagay ko lang siya sa lid ng eyes ko. And then I'm gonna take this darkish pink color and ilalagay ko lang siya sa my waterline. So the next letters are letter F. So first is face powder and for my face powder I'm gonna be using my favorite which is the Laura Mercier Candle Glow Sheer Perfecting Powder in the shade number 3. And I'm just gonna put that all over. Um, I'm gonna be using this L'Oreal True Match Satin Smooth Liquid Foundation in the shade G6. And again, I'm gonna be applying that with my Beauty Blender. Oh, wala lahat ng ginawa ko. <coughs> Goodbye, Bic. Actually, mukha naman siya okay. <laughs> Surprisingly. Next up is highlight. So, for today, I'm gonna be using this um, Glow Boss Shimmer Stick in the shade Hey Girl by Sunny's Face. So, liquid blush or cream blush ang ginamit ko pang sa look na ito. Because I know it will go well with the foundation. Next step is lipstick. So, I have three shades from the Sunny's Face makeup line. So, I have the shades Vacay, the shades Bake. And lastly, nudist. So, ito yung mga pinili ko sa look na ito. So, ang gagawin ko una is, I think I'm gonna be taking the shade called nudist first and apply that all over my lips. And then sa center naman, para my ombre effect, I'm gonna be applying this color called vacay. Gusto ko tong lip color na to, but para my dimension... Actually, wait ka lang, ha? Kunin ko yung red lips. Instead of applying the shade called Nudist, Nudist ata yun, I vacay pala. Instead of applying the shade vacay from Sunny's face, I placed instead sa center um, the shade called Major and then linan ko na lang siya sa outer corners. Lips, ang gagawin ko now is mascara. So for mascara, I'm gonna be using this one by L'Oreal. This is the L'Oreal Volume Voluminous Lash Paradise Mascara. Honestly, ang ganda ng mascara na to. I highly, highly, highly recommend. Second to the last step sa makeup process na ito is the primer. Sometimes, ang ginagamit ko na primer is yung mattifying, sometimes yung hydrating, and minsan, gumagamit din ako ng primer water. So, consider naman to as primer kasi the name says primer water. So, 
primer pa rin. Um, the bad thing is, it's a liquid product and I just applied mascara. So, I'm scared na once I spray it, it's going to make my mascara go down. But the mascara claims to be waterproof. So, it will test the waters and see kung waterproof pa talaga. So, I'm gonna spray the primer water. Last step of this look is the setting spray. So, gagamitin ko tong Clinique Moisture Surge Facial Spray to set my makeup and then we are done with the look. Ito na yung end ng challenge na ito, but let's just take a look at my skin. So, what I can see is that ang pangit tingnan ng skin ko. It that is because hindi natin na set yung foundation with the powder and the powder is underneath the foundation so mas emphasize yung mga imperfections ko meron ako sa mailong dito sa cheeks ko forehead yun ang dami lumabas lalo and then with the highlight i mean the highlight looks fine honestly at the eyeshadow looks fine but ang weird ang feeling. Parang siyang basa na oily na ewan ko. And I have dry skin so it looks like parang na-emphasize lalo yung dry ko na skin. Especially in this area right here. Like can you guys see that? I know. Mga smile lines. Yo. Kawa natin tong challenge na to. Hindi ako bumitiw. I kept going. So if you guys enjoyed this video and want to see more challenges from me, then please hit the thumbs up button down below. And if you are not yet subscribed, then join the family, you guys. We are a growing, 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 die English, die. We are a growing army. We are a growing family right here. So go click the subscribe button down below and also click the bell to be notified every time I upload a video and so far I've been uploading three times a week so jinx knock on wood na hindi magka weird ang upload schedule ko so guys I'm just quickly going to insert that I still have a giveaway going on so if you guys are following me on Instagram then you already know the deal you guys already know how this giveaway will work but if you guys have not yet followed me on Instagram then go ahead follow me here and dito yung name ko search me on Instagram and the only things that I need to do to join the giveaway is to first be subscribed to the channel and follow me on Instagram and lastly comment doon sa Laura Mercier first impression foundation video ko which I will leave down below. Um, just comment in the comment section why you love makeup and that's about it. I'm gonna be checking if you guys follow the rules and yeah hopefully you guys join because you still have a few days left to join the giveaway. Please tell your friends and family that wanna win makeup. So guys follow me on Instagram para makita nyo yung mga products na ilalagay ko sa giveaway because I am almost done with them. <laughs> I ko na bilhin lahat, guys. So I hope you guys join the giveaway. And yeah, I think that is about it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Bye.